Brothers and sisters, peace be with you. Today is Monday, January the 2nd, and I'm going to share with you the visions and audible voice that were given to me yesterday, Sunday, January the 1st. So first of all, Happy New Year. Now, uh, yesterday, I received about 25 plus visions plus audible voice i think i miss out quite a few near to 30 or near to all together maybe up to 30. now please remember the lord has given us two greatest commandments that is to love the lord our god with our heart or mind or soul and our strength and to love our neighbors as we love ourselves so each day we move along the path of righteousness into holiness now please remember the day is getting closer but not getting further and be ready and also get ready your family members friends and relatives now and uh, first of all for the scripture we go to ephesians chapter 3 verse 1 to 5 all day something remember that the lord called us to get ready three gifts that faith hope and love and that make sure every day this gift is getting bigger all right so ephesians chapter 3 verse 1 to 5 and that is from a video if you can understand mandarin go to the video and listen to the reading all right and, and i'm going to read again in case okay you don't understand mandarin and after all it's good to read the scripture right and good for us so and come to know the word of god and come to know god even better and better each day now it's Apostle Paul talking about God's marvelous plan for the Gentile. As you know, Apostle Paul reached out to the Gentile, right? He was a Jew and he reached out to the Gentile. He was called to do his mission work to the Gentile. So this is what Ephesians he wrote to the Ephesian church. And verse 1, for this reason, I, Paul, there's Apostle Paul, the prisoner of Christ Jesus. At that time, he was already in the prison for the sake of the Gentile. And surely you have heard about the administration of God's grace that has uh, that was given to me for you all right so he said you have heard about this administration of god's grace that being shown to apostle paul and uh, for the gentile and that is the mystery made known to him to apostle paul to me the meet apostle paul all right by revelation now what revelation well as you know just like us we receive visions we heard audible voice and just like apostle paul taken to the heavens you know all these things uh no apostle john all right in revelation and even i believe apostle paul too was taken to the third heaven and so on right the third heaven as we believe that it is the new heaven new earth all right now maybe that that time it was already there but it has not been constructed as we have it today now uh as i have already written briefly as uh, apostle paul said i have already written briefly about the mystery that made known to him by revelation and in writing this apostle paul said then you will be able to understand my insight into the mystery of christ you know so that you can understand the mystery into of christ just like what we receive every day the visions and audible voice and so on and the dreams well that is the insight into the mystery of christ is still going on as you know uh the bible even though it's only one thick book is you know it is just only for the how to say for the young christian if you want to be a mature Christian, okay, you're eating meat, you have to move close to God. It's beyond that. It's your build up the relationship that is an intimate relationship with Christ Jesus. And then you can come and go into the body of Christ. You can know about a, a lot of mystery in the kingdom of God. Actually, there's one thing. I have never been taken to the heaven. I was uh, taken, uh, how to say it? Uh, I saw the heavenly door greeted me for many years, all right? Uh, many years, several years, okay, before I've been, uh, been brought into this task to do the decoding and before I was taken to new heaven, new earth. Right, so let's, is uh, what the word that I've been doing is, I can say is talking about new heaven, new earth. Maybe it's a uh, continue from Apostle Paul in Revelation. Apostle Paul? No, Apostle John. I'm so sorry. 
Now next one. That's why uh, I saw Apostle John two times. All right. And he was so close, so close to me, really close. You know, his face was so close to me. And I'm so glad to have all the friends in the Bible. And we are going to meet them. And they will be our good friend. And we shall be, uh, we work together. How exciting. Yeah, I feel really excited to work together with them. Of course, cannot be compared with them. But somehow, you know, in the heaven, in the new heaven, new earth, they don't compare whether how much, how holy you are or, or what and what, what and what. No, they are all the same. And so when we go there, we are all the same. How nice, isn't it? So, verse 6. This mystery is that through the gospel of, Gen of the Gentile, uh, eh, this mystery is that through the gospel, the Gentiles are heirs together with Israel. Yes, can you still remember? We are attached to Christ, or we are in Christ, we are attached to Abraham. We are the inheritance of the heir of Abraham, right? Now, we are members together of one body and sharers together in the promise in Christ Jesus. Verse 7, I became a servant of this gospel by the gift of God's grace given to me through the working of His power, through the working of the Holy Spirit. Okay, so I just read up to here. So please continue, you know, when we read Bible, we feel so excited and it's so good to read because it is related to us, right? Do you find that? When we read the Bible, as if they are related to us, okay, we are in the Bible too. <laughs> now, next one uh, is another video is talking about worshiping, is talking about humble heart. And then you can go to, uh, they got, if I'm not wrong, they got English, uh, uh, English wording, you know. So go to it and enjoy. This is a beautiful song talking about this humble heart. When we have the humble heart, they and by God's grace follow the will of God and do what the Lord asks us to do. We will be enter, we will enter the kingdom of God. Without a humble heart, there's no way a person can enter the kingdom of God. So everyone should be like put yourself as a little child, okay? It's not that you should be a child, a Christian all the time. No, you need to grow up, we need to grow up, but our you know when you scold little children, okay? When they have done something wrong, the ch uh, the children the children will, will be very quiet, and knowing that they are wrong, and they put their head very low, and they change their uh, how to say they repent, right? They they know they are wrong, they will not do it again. So what happen if a person is not humble? He or she will say, "Why do, I don't think I'm wrong? You know, I'm stronger than you. I know better. I know God better than you. And I, whoever, whoever put himself or herself high above all." <laughs> now thinking of the song above all. Now next one. Let's go to the journal page. I mean, now let's look at the journal page. We are expecting to go home on the 9th and tenth of March. And the Jewish calendar is Adar, that is the 12th month, the 16th and 17th. That is after half months. Uh, year call, uh, I mean half month is enough. So the other half is for the 16th and the 17th and so on. But 18th, we shall not be here. And then next one, the lunar calendar is the second month, one month after the Chap Gome. And there is the in the second month, Chinese second month, the 18 and 19. So 18 and 19, these are the numbers that we kept on seeing last year. Uh yeah, it's last year, beginning of last year and the year before, all right. Uh quite a few times on the number one that side. Now let's come to this one now. And then below that, they are the final, uh, final uh, four steps. Okay, now four, five steps. We have already, the last one already gone through. And then uh, we are now on the step that is 22nd and 23rd of December up to the middle of January. Another two weeks time, we will finish the 15th to 16th. And then we will go up to another step is up to the February 8th and 9th. And after February 89, 24 days later, 5th and 6th of March. And then another 4 more days for that day, then go into 9th and 10th of March. So these are the steps that we decoded, okay, by God's grace. Alright, let's come. We thank God. Uh, next one. 
let's look at number one. All right. So yesterday I received uh I've been able to record down is a is a twenty five okay plus audible voice, but I missed out quite a few. Now, why? Because as you know, I try to prepare some nice food for my family. You see, and uh, the children. Uh, the my grandson, okay, the other grandson is having holiday. I just want him to have a how some special food, all right. So and together with uh, we have a lot of work to do as well on this uh, journal page and so on. So anyway, God has been very gracious. Let's look at number one. Uh, that is, I saw my younger grandson. We call him Joe. Okay, Joe means dear sweetheart. And his name actually is Joseph, given by God. And the elder one is Joshua, Joshua, and then Joseph. And this Joseph, okay, he was sitting at the table, and behind him was dark. You know, we here in New Brunswick, Canada, here by four o'clock is already very dark. Okay, so he was sitting there. In front of him was a chopping board, and at the corner from his side, okay, uh, on the right hand side, lower down, they got about eight. You know, I can say about eight. Eight pieces of this little dough. You know, when you make dumpling, you you have you cut the dough, uh, into little pieces. Okay, little pieces. It's about eight like this, and then you look at his hand, and then his hand was like, what am I going to do with my hand? So with the with the dirt, you know, with with the dough, with the flour, and so on. You know, when you look at his hand, it give you, uh, the wisdom that is eight. Okay, the Chinese word eight, right? Eight. Ba ba. So, if you look at the time, it's nine forty-seven. Four plus seven equal to eleven. Eleven means ruptured, and nine means in the west we are going home on the ninth of March. And what about the eight? In the past, we saw quite several visions, eight and nine attached together and in different colors. Now that seems mean that in the west, here in New Brunswick, we are going home at eight p.m. Could it be? Yes. Oh, it can be eight to nine p.m. somewhere there. Yeah, it could be nine. No, I make it make sure. Now in the, I I believe the Lord will show us more, uh, clearer and clearer. So so far as we know, going home eight o'clock in some of the places nine o'clock and so on. Okay, so the Lord is gradually leading us to talking about the the hours. Now you say, Lily, you know the Bible tells us that you know Lord Jesus said no one knows the day and the hour, not even the Son of Man. Now remember, the Lord says, "Son of man." When he was here on earth, here, son of man. Okay, now he is already in the heaven. And when he went back to the Father, he was sitting on the right hand side of the Father. He has the authority. All right, um, the Father give him all the authority. So please don't tell me. Do the same thing. The Lord want us to have the wisdom. And then remember, we are doing the decoding. We are the group that. You know, in Amos chapter three verse seven, uh, um, Amos chapter three verse seven, the, the Lord say it's a long time ago to that verse. Oh no, before certain event happening, the God, okay, Jehovah God, uh, will show to his his servants, his prophets, okay, the I can't remember before it happened will tell will show to the. Uh, to his prophets and his servants. Okay, uh, his prophets and his servants. So now we are the servant of God. We are doing the decoding. So of course, only our group. Okay, I don't know about others. You know, maybe they are shown very close. I can say very, very close. You know, to the day, uh, to the hours, and so on. Uh, going home. Now. Maybe they will be given. It's just that for us, we are doing the decoding. We just have to finish our task. All right, everybody. All right, next one. Okay, it's a white plate with rice, and there's there's a sausage. Do you know sausage? Sausage. Uh, just like in the Canada, your curling sausage, uh, the Western sausage. Okay, hot dog that you use it to 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 make hot dog that kind of sausage, and is、uh, pointing from the、uh, middle point, middle center pointing to the eight o'clock position, and then this plate uh the is the Lord tilted as if it's the rice and the sausage is going to the eight o'clock position, it's going to fall off. 
Now, in my mind, came to me is going to, to pour, the load was going to pour into the steamer. Now we know that the steamer is talking about the portal, portal to the new earth. Okay, it's going to pour into the portal to new earth. Eight is pointed to eight o'clock. Now, please remember different places have different time zones. So I'm still, uh, yes, quite sure 60%, but not 100% sure yet whether New Brunswick is really eight o'clock plus. When I say eight o'clock, it's not eight o'clock sharp. Okay, please, everybody, just give some time, give extra time. Okay, <laughs> unless the Lord show us really sharp. Okay, I. I don't dare to say it's eight o'clock sharp. I know that it's more than later than eight o'clock. Okay, a little bit, a little bit because oh yeah, next one. It's like this: a plate full of beautiful food. Okay, ah, uh, they got veggie, they got some other food, beautiful like New Year food. Okay, with all the colors, with a number of colors, and then there's a carrots, carrots like a hand of the knee of the clock pointing to nine o'clock but at the nine o'clock there is a, a, a tail like this tilted up a little bit so that's why i say one is eight o'clock one is nine a little bit that mean um, could be beyond eight o'clock okay so everybody and then this one eight o'clock one i believe he's talking about 8 p.m uh yep another thing is when we hear new brunswick is 8 p.m 8 plus p.m the China and Malaysia should be 8 plus a.m. Now, Japan should be 9 plus a.m. And uh, many, several years ago, I saw a, a few visions of Japan. There's one that I want to tell everybody. I saw there's a kitchen floor like this. It was flooded. And the plates was broken into half. Now, does it mean that there will be tsunami because there's a volcano eruption day and there could be something very big coming to Japan. So that is several years ago. So this time, this clock, does it mean a Japanese time, time zone? Now, when the Lord in the rapture, there could be some, uh, how to say, some signs in the heaven, something may happen really happen in the in the world okay during the rapture so just get ready be raptured if you are left behind okay then that's it there's nothing nation of the teeth so be ready don't be left behind don't take god for granted never take god for granted move close to god all the time all right when you are in the car listening to the worshiping song, not love story, all right? Not love story in the world. Love story for Christ, yes. And then when you have you you would like to watch YouTube, watch YouTube to worship God. Watch YouTube on the world. Please don't go to all the video. Okay, all the video in the YouTube. A lot are very mistaken. Actually, this morning, uh, I uh, yesterday uh, I came across uh, actually. It's a Bible, it's a daily break. It's not the daily break that we're using, okay? Yeah, and then the brother who is sharing about the scripture and he shared about war events and it was utterly, utterly wrong. Totally wrong. He was following the BBC, CNN, and is he was supporting the B system. He didn't even know that he was supporting the B system, you know. What a disaster. So everybody, be careful when you watch YouTube uh, video, you have to really ask for this sermon. All right. And even if you watch BBC CN, be careful, be careful. Ask God for this sermon. That when you watch, you don't feel good. You don't have the peace. Then don't watch. All right. <sighs> Let's look at number two. Uh, I, I saw uh, like a spoon or like a small sieve like this. It's dark in color. It may refer to the full dark day or whatever. And then uh, there's a liquid coming out. The liquid came out is golden color. And this reminds us the golden word of God. In other words, the word that we have from the Lord, they are the chosen word of God. And they are as precious as gold. That's why if you go to uh, Psalm chapter 119, okay, Psalm 119, and then verse 140 is talking about uh, the word of God, his promises, 
is trustworthy. It's like gold. Now, next one is I saw the works at the northeast direction. Tian bigger works. Tian Tian means every day. Jie uh, zi, that means every day you look forward to the day of going home. All right. Now, next one is uh, is the journal page, and right in the middle, uh, going down, I think maybe seven or eight line like this, or not seven or eight after after six line, the seven line like this. Okay, so the word ge ge means song, and then zhang de jia yi qie. What does it mean? Like, zhang de jia yi qie. Uh, that mean uh, that mean we should have family that worship God. Everything we praise the Lord. We praise the Lord for what we have. We praise the Lord for human being. We praise the Lord for everything that we have. Even the cup that you use for morning coffee. Even the cup, the cup that you use for your water. Thank God for that. Because everything that we have, even we ourselves, belongs to God. And that is, you know, sometimes because of my legs and uh, uh, and for convenience sake, I may use my leg to do something, to push something. And I just feel that it is so impolite, you know. And I always say to God, God, please forgive me. And I always heard the Lord say, I forgive you, okay. So please, everything that you have, everything that you see belongs to God. Because we have gone through so much already, all the vision and, and also the word of God teaching us that everything belongs to God and it is so true. So true. Okay, please never take God for granted. Now, next one is, I saw, <clears throat> sorry, excuse me. I saw uh, the word xiang fen la, and then this fen la became la. Okay, there should be a gap there. So, xiang is thinking, fen, separation. Look to finish. Okay, so first of all, Xiang has got 13 stroke. 13 stroke remind me of 6 plus 7. 7 plus 6 equal to 13. And 7 is 7, 17. And then 6, 16. And that is Ada, the Jewish calendar. Ada, 17 and 16. 16 and 17. All right. Now, if you add another uh, 12, okay. So 7 and 6 plus 12, it gives us 19 and 18. It's a Chinese calendar. So this time we are not wrong anymore. We believe this is the final. You know, of course, every decoding step, they are correct. But it says that we had not reached out to the final. But this time we believe this is really the final, okay? Because here it says here, here, 想分了,分, 分想, 分, 分, means separation. On the 13, 13 is 7 plus 6, right? Okay, next one, 想了, mean uh, already thought about it. Okay, that means already got it, 13, 7, 6, all right, that's to finish. Now, next one is a white, white bowl. Inside the white bowl, I saw some cooked oats, cooked, already cooked oats, all right? And then there's a silver spoon, like a Chinese silver spoon. Uh, in the East, we are using that kind of spoon, silver color, stainless steel or whatever. And the three o'clock position, three o'clock means to finish, spoon means salvation. And then uh, there's this oak there. Now, oak is a creamy color. Creamy reminds us of new heaven, new earth, creamy. And that is the a uh, land of milk and honey, right? Land of milk and honey is the new heaven, new earth. So three o'clock salvation, that means much we are going into eternity. We are going to the promised land. Okay, actually just now I have received a vision. It's talking about our life on this earth is going to terminate. Of course, we, we go up with our body, okay? Don't think that our body will die here and then... No, 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 no. We are going up with our body, please. All right, next one is... I saw a boundary like this and then there's a lady upside down. That means heaven is coming down. And then next one is... I saw two recording. Uh, recording and then uh, the top one with a, with a triangular arrow. And the lower one with a triangle. Now, actually, this morning, it give, finally gave me the revelation. This can refer to the last circle and then going up, okay? And then it can refer to the last two months, okay? I've been asking the Lord, why is it last two months, Lord? We have it until March then. Then 
if you calculate the day, okay, 68 days to go, 68 divided by 2 is 34. And we also kept on seeing 34, 3, 4, 3, 4, right? So in other words, these 68 days, the Lord can divide into two sections, all right? Two sections. That's why sometimes we saw two sections. And then next one, I've been asking the Lord, then the Lord, like, shaking something in front of you. Can you can you imagine someone shaking something in front of you? Uh, a rack, a small rack shaking in front of you? You really have the feeling, you know, and you really saw it as far. Well. And then in front of me was a rock. Actually, it's a rock. And it, it, the back side is black color. And then the other side I saw with a, with a, is, is like what? Like, uh, like, 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 I don't know how to say it. It's like wool, like this, woolen, like this, woolen, okay? With beautiful colors, white woolen, beautiful, with blue, with pink, and so on. So they got two sides, to folded into half. So this, it is a rectangular. If this is a square, then I may say that it's for that day, but it is a rectangular. So most probably, as I said already, this 68 days is divided into two sections. So 34 and 34. Now, next one is, uh, you look at the time, it's 6 o'clock, okay? 6 o'clock until 6, 6 can, uh, there's a vision that I saw, is joy on 6. 6 can refer to the 6th day of the week, it's Friday, it's the East going home. Next one, I saw Yang Meng, okay? He was sitting at the table, uh, and there's a table to separate us. And then he was looking up into the heaven, looking up, okay, that means his, his eyes is looking up to my top, head top, okay. Uh, and then his head was two, two fists like this. Yeah, like this, more or less like saying, yeah. What does my yeah? Yeah means we are going home. 2023 okay 2023 2023 this is 2023 it's the first day it's the new year we are going home hallelujah that is his feeling that's how i saw his, the, his expression okay and then next one is uh, oh yeah below him okay at the table uh there's two uh one is a line it's white color from the seven o'clock into one o'clock Another word, divine completion into new beginning. Yeah, this year, but we are going, divine completion, we're going into new beginning. And then there's a word, Chinese word, pao. Pao means wrap up. Wrap up, wrap up means what? Means come to the final, right? Wrap up, come to the conclusion, the final. So please, everybody, uh, there's no joke, all right? <laughs> and then next one, it's like this. I heard a young girl calling me from a distance and she called me ama ama and now this is not the first time actually within two weeks i heard this is the third or fourth time already so before that i was cooking and i heard someone call me ama and before they also ama all right and then this time it's really really clear you know clearer than what you hear in, on this earth you know it's really really clear and remind me of my daughter it's like this when my husband was so sick about 30 years ago more than 30 years ago and really sick and out for many years all right at that time it was the beginning it was so terrible and i had an abortion my abortion two times okay so the Lord revealed to me several years ago, I have a daughter there waiting for me to go home. And then he did not reveal to me a son. And then after the daughter, I saw a, a young man, okay, uh, through the door like this, okay. And she, he was far away, uh, some distance. And then the Lord later told me that that is my son, okay. So I will have a daughter and a son. And my, the Lord told me that my son is a very handsome man, okay, handsome young man. So praise the Lord. I'm so glad. And then, of course, my children, okay, these two children, they will be with me. And as you know, my earthly, um, on here, uh, on this earth here, I have my eldest son. Is uh, He is uh, already got married near to 40 years old. He has his family and my daughter here living together with me, okay. Uh, and then uh, she has two sons, okay, and the husband, she has her family. So over that side, I believe these two children, they will be with me, all right? So, so good to have children with me. 
and of course my children uh, on uh, on this earth here they have their own family they will be my neighbors as well they will be my neighbors okay just behind our building that's what i saw you know when i went to new earth now i even went to the house you know went to the house and uh it is a beautiful big houses and it's like a semi d one side is my son one side is my daughter okay so big big house now next one uh number 12 number 12 number 12 all right is i saw uh, a pair of scissors scissors is already open coming down from heaven all right and then next one is i saw that the journal page from 1 to 11 like this and the second last that one i got uh and then below that next uh that column uh, there's a line drawn and then written down b man b means must be man means door okay maybe it show us that everyone should have a door everyone should have a door in order to get ruptured so b has got five stroke and man seven stroke if you add them together it's 12 12 means ada ada okay and then when you look at the five 5 plus 12 is equal to 17. 17 Ada is the east going home. Now, 7, well, we keep on seeing 7, 17, right? 7, 17. And 5 plus 12 is equal to 17. So, 17 of Ada is the east going home. That is the Friday. Now, next one is... Uh, yeah, if you, if you look at the journal page from 1 to number 11, number 10, 10... Is this column is 10, right? So it is the 10th of March is the day the East going home. So it's matching, right? Next one, I saw three square like this, or you can say rectangle and uh, very, very bright, okay? Very bright. And then we know that it's January, February, and March. And we are not going to finish March, all right? We are going to finish up to the 10th. And then the rest is none of a business, but of course we have this earth, that's why we need to pray for them. We believe that when we go to the other side, we will also, we will still continue to pray for those on this earth here. Okay, let's look at here. Uh, when I was on, the, uh, when I was, I had a visitation to the new heaven, new earth, I saw, you know, uh, I can say in the uh, open air, uh, uh, with chase there and they got people keep on praying keep on praying keep on praying for this earth all right now next one is uh is a bowl i think it's a bowl or a mixing bowl okay inside got water and then they got two leaves at least two and there is another one like a little bit only so the lord use the chopstick to stir stir anti-clockwise anti-clockwise means countdown so that means we are now on the countdown and then next one uh as you know look at the page the countdown yesterday 69 today is 68 all right so the last one is one the second last is the west going home is two and then one all right next one is i saw the lord's hand the first finger and second fingers and then the third fingers you know what happened to the third fingers is only one third okay so the main first fingers talking about january second fingers talking about february and the third fingers talking about march and march we only have one third and the last two fingers i also saw the last finger the no name and the last okay you can see it said lily how come there are five fingers i thought it's only four fingers plus one thumb wow the lord can show us whatever way isn't it so he used the fingers to give us the numbers, all right? So the seven is staying for divine completion. That is a no name. And the last one is the six. Six means Friday. Okay, divine completion on Friday, all right? It's the sixth day of the week. All right, next one. Uh, as I said already, I saw vision many years ago. Joy on six. That means on Friday. There's the east going home on Friday. And then next one is the background. So the word gong zhuo. Gong zhuo means uh, the task, the job that we are doing. All right. And then in front of the back, in front of the word is le. Le means to finish. Le means to finish. And it looked like three as well. Right. So that means our task is done. Our task is done. So everybody 
being ready, we still, every day we still have journal page as the Lord revealed to us revelation in turn of visions and audible voice. Maybe at times God dream. I think I got a short, short dream this morning. I cannot remember. Oh dear. Okay, I hope I did record down. Okay. And then uh, this today up to now, I have received 30, if I'm not wrong, it's 38 visions already. 38 visions already, okay, plus audible voice. So the next one, I I try my best, all right, try my best. So everybody be ready for home. Don't be left behind, reach out to your family member, your children, your grandchildren, and remember your in-laws and so on, okay, and be ready in Jesus' name. Amen.